Good eye mates, my name is Dr. Shermy, and I'm your therapist for today. Any problems you have, I can fix. As you can see, I don't have an office, so you're going to help me make one. Welcome to Two Point Hospital. Now, since I'm your new therapist, you probably still don't know my name, and my name again is Dr. Shermy. I'm your therapist. Now, back in Australia, I used to have, I was the, I was the number one therapist. I was the number one therapist in my league. I solved all the problems. So now I have to rebuild in the US. Now, so let's begin. Just infection is no listen here, mate. I don't care. I'm here to, listen mate, I'm here to relieve the people of the US of their problems. Welcome to Two Point County. I'm Albert Crank. I'll be a trustee. All right. I am going to be the mother freaking best <coughs> therapist in the US now, too. Let's go. Two Point Hospital. Welcome to Two Point County. This is where I live. Two Point County, my favorite day. Are you ready to start building your first hospital and curing some patients? Listen here. Any, any problems I can solve. Holy shit, it's hot in this freaking vest. Jesus. Looking around the hospital, I don't care. I really have to go through this dumb tutorial. Reception, the first thing the hospital will need is a, recep is a reception. Not a receptionist. I could be the receptionist. I, I am welcoming to everybody. Hello, my name is Dr. Shermy. How are you? Get in my office. Patients will head over there when they, when they arrive at the hospital. Let's build a reception desk near the entrance. Near the entrance, back in, back on, down under, we had to, reception desks were hard to get into. Reception desk, right here. That looks like a great place for a receptionist. Great, now we need an assistant to run reception. Let's hire one now. Listen here, I am one man stand man. Now, do we want to hire someone really good at what they do or not? Eh, she's fine. I like her spunk, Antonia. She looks, she sounds like she's from down under. Higher. There you go. General practitioners. Uh, no, we need the therapist's office. Therapist's office comes first. Holy bollocks. This hospital is freaking massive. My little, co my therapist shop down and down under was a quarter of the size. Maybe not even a quarter. This is the size of, my office was the size of this room. My entire thing was the size, of, the size of this room. Have a look at the message in the right, bottom right. Looks like we need to build a pharmacy. No one needs a therapist right now. Are you kidding me? Mate, I am so pissed, mate. Everyone's got to wait. Everyone's got to get diagnosed. Everyone's got to get, everyone has down under disease. Listen, back in Australia, when everything was trying to kill you, I was number one therapist. I took your problems away. What is happening here? They're getting cured. You guys are getting cured. Don't you worry. They drank absolutely nothing. What the fudge is that? And they walked away. You could have went to the 7-Eleven the down the street for that. Patient cured. Well done. You've cured our first patient. Not for long. We've earned some money and the hospital's reputation has improved, which will attract more patients. When a doctor or nurse treats a patient, their ability will influence the chance of success. Some illnesses are tougher than others. Oh, just like freaking uh, little Joey just punched your child in the face. Sorry, dear. So we can expand the hospital. All right. Shut up. I'm basically running a 7-Eleven here. I'm mixing freaking drinks. Oh, God. Americans are so fat they can't even run two blocks across the street to go get a 7-Eleven. Janitors and maintenance. Now that we've had some expensive machinery, we should think about looking after it. Machines will deteriorate with use and we'll need preparing from time to time. What about the Joeys trying to knock down my windows? If a machine falls into, dis into disrepair, it can be a fire hazard. That's not proper English. I'm from Australia, I should know I got an A in English. If a machine falls in this disrepair, comma, it can be a fire hazard. Fires can are generally considered uh, bad for business. 
back in Australia. Joey's mountain crawlers, emus were considered bad for business. Fires were the tip of the iceberg. All right, more freaking 7-Eleven Slurpees and more everything, keeping people happy. Do I give a damn about keep, keep, keeping people happy? I'm here to solve problems and I did a banging job at it. Now they can just stare at drinks and sodas. That's what we did back down under. Burp and cheese gobbins. I think we had that back in Australia. Holy shit. Cheat, they have cheesy gob gobbins. Staff energy and breaks. Staff get tired as they work and will eventually go on break. A staff room will help them relax and... Jesus Christ, and yet the therapist's office is last. What the fudge? Why is the therapist's office always last? Back in Australia, it was just me. It was just me working. But no, at, back here in freaking America, everyone needs to freaking take a break, don't they? I'm wondering when the goddamn, when I'm gonna about to build the goddamn therapist, therapy room. I can't do therapy without a therapy room. All right. All right, Shermie, stay calm, stay calm. You will get your your thing, you will, you will. Newsflash, there's a particularly, particular, peculiar. You know, I didn't get an A for thing anyway. New peculiar New English in town, lightheadedness. Uh, you just freaking lie down, you don't need to come to the hospital for that. We're going to need some new expensive equipment to deal with this, I swear to God. Continue expanding your hospital to unlock the treatment room. We need also need another GP's office in order. What the fudge? What is this? Everyone's getting more attention than me. I'm supposed to be the 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 heart and soul of this this goddamn hospital. Where the hell is the, the therapist room? How am I supposed to solve problems if this no, if no one has the freaking problems to solve? Our doctors have been diagnosed with a, pa a patient with bed face. What the fudge? All right, all right, all right. What the fudge is bothering me? I'm building, I'm gonna build a goddamn office for me. It's gonna be right here. And it's gonna be the biggest goddamn structure because I'm, go I'm, I'm gonna un un unfire everybody else. We got ourselves a, 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 a ward. I don't know any of this vocabulary. Wards can be used for, for diagnosis. Also, change, treat a range of illnesses. A nurse is required to admit each patient to look after them and discharge them when they're ready to leave. Add multiple dreads. All right, I just built a light. What the bl what the hell? I saw some weird stuff in Australia, but I've never seen someone with a goddamn light bulb on their goddamn heads. What the fudge? There's two of them! Doctor, I have seen some weird stuff. I do not know what the fudge is this. Where the hell did they get fudging light bulbs on their heads? Why isn't there a doctor in this goddamn room? Holy crap! That doctor was playing with a Rubik's Cube! We didn't have those back down under. All right. So we're fixing him. How does this work? What are they doing? They're unscrewing the, the guy's head. He's dead right now. I just saw I just saw someone die and get resurrected again. You say that you say you see everything in goddamn Sydney, but guess what? You don't want you see a freaking bloody freaking light bulb switch out of his goddamn head. Dear hospital administrator, one star hospital. Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded one star. One star? It should be mother freaking five. Oh, it should be mother freaking five! By Two Point Hospital Health Ministry, I have received your fire for my bin to celebrate. Continue to develop your enterprise in Hogsport for further esteem and trinkets if you believe you are capable for more. Alternatively, run before you can walk and expand your organization by opening new hospital and lower bollocks. Oh, you're going to be the dog's bollocks in a second. 
The, the choice is yours, they say. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It should have been goddamn five stars. My hospital back and down under. Best for freaking hospital. You've never seen hospitals this good. Do I get to build another hospital? Do I get to build another hospital that is actually... Like... I get to actually be my goddamn thing that I want to be a therapist? Alright. Alright, guess one. Guess what? We're gonna be... We're, we're gonna have two hospitals. Because guess what? We are the freaking best. Staff qualifications. Okay, welcome to Lower Bollocks. Now that's my type of town. I think I should... It's a lovely little village with a big problem. A significant portion of the population should be rock stars. There's only one thing to cure this. Psychiatry! Thank you! Thank you! Finally, I am recognized for what I want. It's, it's, for, it's a new dawn, mates. It's a new dawn. We will finally be the ones that we need to be. Only doctors with okay. I, none of them, none of them is me. All right, fine. We'll go for Brendan. He's gonna be my successor. I'm gonna teach him from the sidelines. Brendan, you better not let me down. Chutney, that's a good source. Now we are going to build a psychiatry. Finally, I will get what I need. Psychiatric rooms are always super big. And you can enter from here. All right, finally! I will get, I am getting what I need here. There we go. Okay, now we're gonna put in some extra knacks in my own office. We're gonna put a nice little filing cabinet. Two, two filing cabinets because guess what? All I ever wanted was to sit in that chair. All I ever wanted was that chair. All I ever wanted was me on this chair. All I wanted was me on this chair. Now I do. Now I can ask questions. Who, who's gonna be first up? Brendan? All right, all right, we have our first patient. We have our first patient. All right, now tell me, how does this make you, how does this make you feel? All right, okay, okay, you say you have, you're, you're awful at your work ethic and everything else. Don't worry, we got you, we got you. You know what we have to diagnose you for? We have to diagnose you for or, or sometimes, all right. You're gonna need to get out more in your house. See, he looks so much better. I have transformed mother freaking men. I have finally been complete. Now I can finally be, Brendan, don't sniff the plant. That's for patients only. I'm finally achieving my dreams. I think I am the, I am the best therapist that this world's ever seen. Of course, I got this, Dr. Swami. Okay, please, tell me more. I feel like I eat too much cheese. Like, I, I, I eat too much of it, there's so much of it in my brain. I just, I just don't know what to do. What do I do? Okay, 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 all right, man. I can work around it. Am I getting fatter? Am I getting skinnier? Should I work out more? Okay, now tell me. How does that make you feel? Okay, mate, the floor is yours. Fern pants me. During school. Right, all right. And it's just been bothering me all the time. Like, I have dreams of people pantsing me all the time. And it's like, I have to wear like three belts. And I, I don't know what to do about it. All right, now tell me, how does that make you feel? <sighs> All right, you've been here a couple of times. I know exactly what your thing is, but please tell me more. Now tell me, how does that make you feel? <laughs>